All right, guys. So we've got the Dallas Cowboys at the Washington football team. And we are going to go to Washington and we're going to take care of business and we're going to win this division. All right. So what I was hoping to do for the game are these fried mushrooms and some fried onion rings. And also besides that, we were gonna do some prosciutto, goat cheese, arugula egg rolls. And I'll get to those in a minute. But here's what we've got going on with the fried mushrooms. As you can see, looks really nice. And I'm gonna make up a few more of these off camera and I'll you know make up a small batch of these. And so then also here is the onion ring that I'm going to basically try to make the same way with the same batter. We'll see how it is. It's got Italian seasoned breadcrumbs. You know, this bowl of panko is basically just panko seasoned breadcrumbs and Italian style breadcrumbs. That There's nothing else in this, just two different kinds, maybe even actually like three different brands of different kinds of breadcrumbs and panko and stuff. So same ordeal with the spreading on this, you know, just push it down real hard, get it real good. I think that the onion rings are going to be a little bit harder, but we'll just see how they do. Looks like I may have broke this one too, but I'm going to be a little more gentle with, uh, with the rest of these. So yeah, just some of the excess breading falling off. So you guys will see me either rock these onion rings or they'll come out. Okay. But I'm going to try to make it you know, adjust as I make these off screen. So I'll be right back with the egg rolls and I'll show you the end product yeah, of the, yeah. all three things. Mm. All right, guys. So yeah. here is more of yeah. the mushrooms breaded up and we did some more of the yeah. onion rings up. Obviously it's not the regular yeah. way you would do the yeah. onion rings, but I'm just, you know, trying, trying this recipe for the breaded mushrooms out on the onions. So, what we've got here is the goat cheese, the arugula, the old world prosciutto, and we're gonna do, you know, make this into egg rolls, like we were saying. And, um, you know, my advice on rolling egg rolls is to just get it nice and tight without rolling it too tight because the more air pockets you leave in, you know, the, the more grease can get inside and, you know, you just wrap them good and tight, as tight as you can, no big deal. But, um, you know, just to, just to touch on the Washington game one more time. Last year, when Dak was hurt, we had to go play Washington. And they hurt our backup quarterback, Andy Dalton, who was the starter since Dak had gotten hurt. You know, he ended up getting knocked out of the game in Washington. Our guys didn't really have much to, you know, say or do about it, really. And I was kind of disappointed in our offensive line and our players that didn't do much about Dalton getting knocked out so um, I'm hoping that we can go and avenge last year or getting swept Dak is seven and one Dak has only lost one time in his life to the uh, Washington football team and he actually hasn't played uh, coach Rivera yet he's only he played Jay Gruden's team in 2019 but he didn't get to play Washington last year like I said it was Dalton and then uh, maybe Dalton again I can't remember. I think maybe Dalton played both games. But basically, we're looking for revenge from last year. We're looking to all, but, you know, we're not going to officially wrap up division if we win. But we've basically got division if we win. So let's just go to Washington, get this win. It'll make the last four games of the football season less stressful. So um, here, I'll show you guys these again one more time. I'm getting ready to drop these um, mushrooms and these onion rings. Well, actually... I'll drop the mushrooms for you guys right now on the spot. These won't take long. And then when I come back, I'll have the onion rings coming out. The shrooms will be out already cooling off. And then we'll see how the mushrooms did. The, I, I've already practiced ran these mushrooms. And oh my gosh, you guys, you are going to love it. I'm, I'm going to have the recipe in the uh, description. Anybody who loves fried mushrooms, you're going to love these fried mushrooms that have the panko on them. They're, um, you know, they're, they're like a top-notch appetizer, basically. So 
I'm gonna have you guys try these out, check these out, and I'll be right back. We'll show you the onion rings, show you how they do, and these awesome apron. All right, guys. So there's the onion rings out. There's the mushrooms. And then there's the egg rolls just came out. And they've got arugula, prosciutto, goat cheese. In the recipe, they've got like a fig spread sauce type of deal. So Tabitha found this. I already tried it and it is delicious. So, you know, in the picture, it's just thrown on there, topped with a little, excuse me, topped with a little chopped arugula. So, you know, this is gonna be delicious. The sweet is on top of the savory and the goat cheese just, you know, goes perfect. Like goat cheese is perfect on a salad that has like any sort of fruit and, or like a sweet vinaigrette. So I personally love goat cheese. I could eat it all the time. So here's an aioli that I made up earlier for this fried stuff, you know, for the fried mushrooms and the onion rings. It just has like ketchup, horseradish, mayo, a uh, little bit of slap your mama Cajun seasoning, you know, for a little extra kick and a cayenne in it. It's really good. I'll have the recipe for the fried mushroom breading, which also went on to the onion rings, you know, so there it is, guys. We last year for Washington, we did the uh, Korean fried chicken, the street food, the Korean fried chicken. So wanted to do appetizers, you know, the hashtag is game day appetizers. I do signature dishes as much as appetizers, if not more. So there it is, guys. Fried mushrooms, fried onion rings, fried egg rolls, goat cheese, arugula, and prosciutto with a sweet honey fig spread on top. Little dress with a little arugula. Tomorrow is Washington, and that means Sam Adams cherry wheat versus the Washington football team. And uh, I'll have recipes in the description. So... Yeah, guys, I'll see you guys next week and check out Jerry Ellen's video. Check out Jim. I think Jim's Kids Kitchen's participating. Create with Linda's usually been doing it. Um, Jerry Ellen's cousin Mel's usually been doing it. I'll have links in the description. So check everything out. Let's beat the football team and let's enjoy some delicious food.